Um, Sam Felson, the fitness business dude there with uh, Zach Cahill. Um, and yeah, Zach, you're going to be running through a uh, clean I'll show you a simple clients. little progression for teaching your clients how to do uh, power clean. Um, okay, so what you want to do is grab the bar, shoulders back, elbows turned out. Okay, the first step, you just bend your knees a couple of inches, all right? Right. like this. So you're not coming forward, you picture sliding your back down the wall. Okay. Okay. From there, you're just going to jump and catch. So you jump, shrug, catch the bar. Alright? So once again, elbows out, shoulders back. Yeah. Bend your knees, jump and catch. And you just do that a couple of times. Okay, you want to emphasize right. when this lands, that's when you're that's stamping when you're your feet. Okay. okay? So that's step one. Yeah. Step two, and you do it at this pace, you slow it down. Right. Bend the knees, bend the hips. Okay, so you get right. to a position where the bar is just above the knees, shoulders ahead of the bar. Yeah. Come back up. Jump and catch. Right. So it's one, two, three, four. Okay? And you'll see them start to get sloppy with it. They'll just start doing that kind of thing. But yeah. just emphasize, okay, take your time. It's just a drill. One, yeah. two, three, four. Right. Okay? Yeah. From there, you pretty much eliminate the pause. Yeah. Right? So you're just coming down. Okay? And then you can start to get them to add, to add in a little squat. So they'll probably they're probably catching the bar in like a quarter squat position. Okay. So then you can say, right, instead of coming up, yeah. just go down into a, into a front squat. Yeah. And back up. And for most people just beginning, that's enough. Like you, you don't have to be doing a full squat clean with them. Yeah. And it's enough just to get the power clean. Just those few little steps. They should get it straight away again they move reasonably well. Yeah. So the whole thing from the top, a couple of reps, bend the knees, oh, jump and catch nice. Alright, then it's one, two, three, four. Okay, and then we do the whole thing together. At that point you might put a little bit of weight on the bar. Yeah, it's a tiny bit. Like five each side, just to have give them something to pull against. Right. And you're just running the whole thing together. Nice and smooth. Yep. Start adding in. So there we are. Squat. Come on, those squats. That's it. Sweet. Um, so yeah, if, if like let's, let's have me have me yeah. try it out. Cool. I'm not super experienced with uh, right. the Olympic lifts, so okay. this will be good. Cool. Good for me. So right. Bar. right. So elbows turned out. Okay. Uh, towards like that. Because right. you want your arms just like ropes. You don't want to just. Using your arms to pull the bar up, yeah. your arms just relaxed okay. like ropes, just elbows turned out. Yeah. Draw your shoulders back at your chest. Okay? Now imagine your back is against the wall, you can slowly go back down the wall about four inches. So, yeah, there, just jump and catch. Yeah, come back down. So, even less of bend the knees. Right. Alright, elbows turned out. Right. Like yeah, big jump, shrug and catch. Okay? So, your catch position needs yeah. to be. Obviously, more there. So I need to right. push those over. Yeah, you, you, you whip the elbows underneath, get the arms high. Okay. It's like, just like a front squat. Yeah. Okay, drop that down and go up again. Bend the knees, jump. Good. Then go right into the throat. Now right find the elbows. Right. right. Bend the knees, jump. Good. That's there. Not bad. Not bad. Maybe more. So bend the knees, jump. Cool. Okay. Bar against the thighs. Now bend the knees. Bend the hips, shoulders ahead of the bar. Okay. Right, so these are tight, knees are still slightly bent. Come back up, knees still bent, jump and catch. Bend the knees. Okay, so take your time, back down to your thighs. Bend the knees a couple of inches, shoulders back. Now, get shoulders ahead of the bar, okay. straighten back up, knees still bent. Yeah, and don't run those into each other, you're going to do those pauses. Do those pauses. Yeah, it's literally this slow. One, two, three.
go, oh, you need to grip your hips at that point, because it's just too fast. No, yeah. So you just have to do these little drills, yeah. and then when you actually do it at full speed, hopefully, yeah. it becomes a little bit smoother. Okay? Sure. Now, take your knees, right? Yeah. Arms relaxed, elbows out, shoulders back. Now, bend your knees a couple of inches. Get those shoulders ahead of the bar, and the hips. Okay, come back up, and then jump! Yep, properly jump with the legs. That was a lot of that was still. Yeah. Give me one more, that's a good one. Now, bend the knees, shoulders ahead of the bar. Back up to the hips now, jump and catch. Alright, so what we're doing now, drop dips. That's not too bad. Okay, no. I'll show you what you're doing. Okay, no, yeah, show me what you're doing. So this is good, and then you're kind of doing this. The time. <laughs> so what we'll do now, right, and this usually just sorts it out, we'll put a bit of weight on it, okay, and you're not going to do those pauses. Yeah. All you're going to do now yeah. is hit that position, which you, if you know what that feels like now, stretch hands, bring shoulders ahead of the bar. Yeah. You're going to hit that position and you just kind of jump up and catch. So you're the whole thing together, and you're going to put a little bit of weight on the bar as well. Because right. it's easy to kind of just, when it's so light, mm -hmm. you just do that. Yeah, yeah. You need something that kind of forces you to lift the legs a little bit. Alright, so, okay. right? right. so you put some clips and bars on your side. And the hips, steps forward, it's nice and low. It's still quite light. Okay, so all I want you to focus on yeah. is get the bars just to the knees. Awesome, I'm going to be there. I'm going to be flying. 